Hello everyone, King Bullet here with some more spell force. So we're heading back up to where I got cornered at the one time uh, in the last episode, and it was like, oh no, I'm gonna die. But I kind of, I guess, accidentally found the entrance to where I had to go. Oh wait, no, I wanted to sell stuff first because I have a lot of garbage. Was that just me, or...? The Song of the White. Yes. There might be blood burn soon. So, that was the song you were talking about? Just trust me. Sod it. Yes. I remember now. I've heard it before. Very faintly, though. I mistook it for the wind. Many people do, I guess. Okay, that was really loud. The song was really pretty. And a little bit off on the whole things being talked about. Mysteries of Shaper's capture, many a uh, scholar's um, imagination is how could a society so advanced in technology and magical ability vanish seemingly over overnight? While traces of the Shaper civilization remain tantalizing historians with glimpses into this once mighty culture, they provide few answers to their origin and downfall. That's one thing. You always hear of advanced civilizations just, poof, disappearing. Uh, I don't understand why, but I can only imagine it's because they done do did the stupid and they killed themselves, pretty much. The Shapers were the pinnacle of civilization. They were the first and perhaps only culture of society of the ancient times to leave a mark upon Eo. If any other such civilizations existed, their remnants have yet to be discovered. While civilizations that followed were primitive and relied on simple tools, the Shapers molded the world with their inventions and magic. Yet around 45,000 TB, the Shapers disappeared. All records of their culture end abruptly at this time, like a candle suddenly sn snuffed out. Many theories exist to explain this. Notably, excavations at a Shaper dig site have uncovered that dragons terrorized the skies as early as 45,000 TB. Did the dragons destroy the Shapers and their entire civilization? Possible, although very few Shaper sites show this type of drag fi dragon fire damage expected of mass extermination. Another theory depends upon turmoil within the Shapers themselves. While their society had long prospered from a strict caste system, what records have survived indicate an uprising of the Yulaz, the priest caste, near the time of their downfall. Could this internal conflict have rotted them from within? Another theory contends that a mysterious disease referred to in one ancient scroll as the Scourge devastated their population. Fire, rebellion, plague, death, the Shapers continue to keep scholars guessing. The end of their society saw a marked loss of technological advancement, pushing back civilizations by thousands of years. Whatever happened to the Shapers, their loss is still felt on EO today. Okay, well, I mean, to be fair, I don't know what I just did. <laughs> I already read that. Uh, I mean, the best wares from Kalea to Northander. You never know what actually happens, um, and being a hundred percent honest. You could sit there and wonder all you want. It's not gonna change anything. Come again, May Tiara bless your. Uh, the fact in the matter is they're gone, and I mean, yeah, wondering is awesome, and I would love to like learn that there's an ancient civilization out there that nobody knew about, and they were so technical, technologically advanced, but. Humans are on track to doing exactly what everybody finds in these games. Where, like, I I guess we get so technologically advanced that we just pretty much kill ourselves. Not like suicide kill ourselves. I mean, like, kill ourselves in the way that we bring about the extinction of the humans because of our own greed and our own lust to continue trying to expand where we should be more focusing on how we can make sure we don't destroy the entire world. Well then, I 
you think there should be it? A chunk of rock. <laughs> a nice At chunk of rock. the risk of blowing your mind, the most prominent feature of a hidden entrance usually is that it's hidden. We just need to find a way to open it. I mean, it's not really that hidden. Uh, all right, let's try this. Zaran Yege Yanor! Brace yourselves. Maybe you mispronounced the words. <laughs> Look, there might be a great many things you can do that I can't, but reading a text from a piece of paper isn't among them. I'm not stupid. Well, but you did say you're not exactly an expert on shaper language. Let us have a try. <sighs> Fine. Whatever. Go ahead. Xaran Nige Yanor. Yeah, see, you mispronounced words. <laughs> Boy, Nihal, if you did it, we opened the door to the lost city. Huh, impressive. Hi. <laughs> impressive. For millennia, no one has ever opened that door. A shapeshifter. I am guessing you're here to avenge your brethren? No. I'm simply intrigued by what you just did. To build an army from pitchfork-wielding villagers and destroy the cowl of an orc tribe is one thing but to open that door that's an entirely different story look i know this might sound odd from orc to human but i might need someone with your skills so if you're interested meet me at the foot of barga gore i think we could help each other hang on why would you want to help me after i killed your brethren they weren't my brethren these orcs you killed were ash reavers. I'm a fire wielder. Well, duh, look at the staff. They had it coming to them. Invading human territory was just foolish. I have no sympathy for them. Either way, consider my offer. I mean, sure, I'd love to have a shapeshifter on my team. Who wouldn't? Well, that was strange. We'll think on this later. Think on this? So you're actually considering his offer? Yeah, we're hey, taking it! The mayor wasn't so wrong about the fact that we might need allies. Now let's go in, shall we? Sure. Lead the way. A another thing, with ancient civilizations and everything, you never know if they actually are still alive. Like, they've just gone somewhere else. Like... Though your legs ache and your stomach burns with hunger, you cannot help but feel a vague sense of anticipation as you descend into the black tunnels. For the first time in a very long time, you feel as if you have direction, purpose. You're pulled from your thoughts as you see shadows dancing on the walls up ahead in the tunnel. A fire. A fire. See, that's what I mean. Like, uh, um, one game that I absolutely adore and love is Dragon Age and in Dragon Age Origins Ugh. is it just me or does it smell rotten in here I'm afraid you're right even though the more pressing question should be why are there lit candles in a place that hasn't been open for millennia but you're certain this is the path to Melendir absolutely something lives down here the only question is what Excuse I me. guess we'll find out uh, see, uh, so Dragon Age Origins, as I was saying, Kiss of Nor, sacrifice a nearby random ally, no, uh, Bloodthirst, dual wielding, two-handers, give me a second, they really applies the status effect to target building workers, science this building will gather resources faster, oh, really? We're gonna go with that, because that sounds helpful. But yeah, so, like, they always said that, uh... The dwarves died and everything else. But, in all reality, what if the dwarves are just... Somewhere else? You know, what if the dwarves have decided to move on from where they were, because there was a lack of materials they were looking for and they wanted to f find a different place you know the same with these guys what if they just wanted to find a different place 
That's my thought in it anyway. I mean, we don't know. We weren't there when the civilization huh? fell. So... What the? what in the blazes was that? I wouldn't know. It was a goblin. Didn't you read it? Oh, I suppose we found the source of that smell. Indeed. But who or what in the world did this? Well, let's follow where it ran. Now would you look at that? Primitive altar is surrounded by a dark magical signature necromancy. Sure. Uh, all right. Why not? That's uh, the way. Strange creatures, but made of flesh. God can. Okay. W. Heal us up, Scotty. Okay. D. D. Him. W. You'll have to wait. You'll have to wait. Uh, more goblin meat. Blasted armor. Thank you. Sounds like a plan. I've, I've killed goblins before. Why am I like? Wh why is my character like? Oh my god! There's a goblin. Oh, good lord! What on earth is that? Am I the only one who just saw that? I'm afraid not. It must have been another goblin. Yeah, and a pretty damn big one. I mean, let's go down this way first, then. Oh, it's just, just another path that I could have taken? Uh, yeah, that's just another path that I could have taken. Learn more about the goblins. Okay. I mean, this is seeming relatively linear. Oh, wait, I can go that way. Never mind, I'm stupid. Wish it was easier to turn the camera. Ooh, wait. Shiny. Gotta love the goblins for having the shiny things. Ooh. Elven Claymore. Focus potion gold. Alright. Let's go check this out. Place goblin me. We best get some cover now. Let's see if this works. Oh wait, I was supposed to do that like that was an actual thing that had to be done da hello oh there he comes what are you well i don't think my cover worked can we stop looking at the fish okay great <laughs> C. I don't know what C does. Not now. You'll have to wait. Heal. Uh, heal, please. Spinny, spinny. Okay, let's do an S on you. Okay. Uh, what does C do? I don't know. What What do you do? Blizzard. Oh, okay. Freeze. Heal. I can't focus. I can't focus. Oh, heal. Nice. Is this really necessary? I can't focus. I can't focus because I'm stupid. Ow. Okay, this is going to actually be really difficult, apparently. Heal. Okay, let, let's try D. Eat you. I will eat you. That's, that's kind of weird to say, dude. Heal. Come on, kill the big old goblin. Yeah, because I cannot heal him with the potion for a little bit. Okay, two, one. Come on. Healing potion. Nailed it. I can't focus. I can't focus. Blizzard. Time to get a little chill in here. Not happening. Not. Focus. Well, you. Okay, you need to run. Or. 
Or let him die. That works too. No, no. Don't die on me, will you? We need you. No. Then, and I just wasted like seven potions on that. Why? I don't know. Poison mushroom. Fantastic. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. Let me guess. Goblins around the corner. No. Cool. Give me. Strange markings on the wood. Huh. Interesting. Don't think we can open it without a key, though. Probably not, no. Smash it open! Find the tunnel to the lost city. Yeah, well, we're working on that one. Learn more about the goblins. You mean by murderizing them? How do you guys see, by the way? Strange children, the bones are unusually sharp to touch. Unusual. Blazes. What is that thing? Looks like a golem to me. Speak the words. Is that my imagination, or did that thing just talk to me? I'm afraid so. You err. Speak the words. Uh, open. Are you certain this is a good idea? This thing looks rather robust. Attack it anyway. Why not? Oh god, that is bad. Okay, everybody get out of the Oh yeah, that's a bad this was a bad idea. Uh it, I should have listened to him when he said bad bad. Okay, cue him. Okay, oh god, oh god, no, back up. Oh, that hurt. Okay, W. Oh god, no, 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 no. Haha, -ha, you missed. Okay, D. Oh, why are you getting hurt? Everybody heal. No, no, no. Oh, you dill holes. What on earth are you doing? Boink. Uh, potion of fresh start. Don't know why that's a thing that I have. Okay, back up, back up, back up, back out. That hurt. Okay, uh, heal. Yeah, so this is was like the worst idea that I could possibly have done. Ow. Okay, see. Get a little frigid over there. Okay, everybody heal. Well, now my character is just stupid. No, no, no. Aha, you missed. Is he healing? He's healing. Crap. No. X him. Oh, get out of there. Go attack him again. I don't think I'm gonna win this. Ow. I mean, he, he's losing health. Ow. Ow. Back 
back up, back up, back up. Ow. My dwarf friend is a little slow. Spin! Oh, he's about to heal again. Crap. I mean, he's not gonna heal as much now, I guess. Oh god. Ow. I just gotta keep healing my guys, I guess. Surprisingly, a little bit easier than the big old goblin dude. Because he kind of attacks slow. Should not have done that one because now she has no focus. There we go. Spin! Oh, we, I stopped him from healing. Oh, back, 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 back. Okay, go attack. Half dead. I think I can get this. I think I can. I think I can. I know I can. Interesting. It's got a quarter health left. Come on. Ow. My dude just always is falling down. I don't know how to stay on my feet, apparently. Why is the goblin dude harder than the golem, exactly? That's something that I want to know. Ow. Spin! Nope, get out of there, get out of there, get out of there. Now would you look at that? Come on. One more. One more. Yeah! We did it, guys! There it goes. I wish I'd had the chance to study it further. You'll get over it. I did it! I'm sure there was a more passive way to do it, but I did it! Nihal's hammer. This is beautiful. I won't argue with that. For once, Iria isn't arguing. Do you feel that? Wind. We're getting close to the exit. The path to Mulandir. Many tales have been told about Mulandir, the lost city of the Shapers. While some scholars go so far as to doubt its very existence, others claim that it was a utopia, an unconquerable city in a valley of never-ending summer. However, they all agree on one thing. Whoever finds it will go down in history. Just like Rudolph. By Nihalf, we've, we've found it. This is amazing. I agree. Now, where can we find clues about the blood burn? Is Grim? Huh? Did you say something? I said, where should we start searching for clues? We need to find out more about the song. Ah, uh, the song. Yes, of course. Do you think we could rest for a moment first, though? I'd like to take some sketches of this place. What a well, marvelous how idea. How we go back to Everlight to get some charcoal first? It's not as if we're in a hurry. <laughs> You're mean. Hmm. All right, I guess you have a point. The only problem is deciphering the shape or tongue isn't an easy task. We can't just walk in here and expect to find the answers we're looking for. Then what do you suggest? I, huh, I assume the nexus would be the best place to start. The heart of the city. The nexus. The nexus? Long story. In short, it's every shaper city's core. It's where they drew the energy for their constructions from, where they created their devices, and, and where they stored their knowledge. All right, then. Let's go. So, I'm in a whole new area. Mullendeer, the lost city. Uh, who knows? Maybe we'll find some shapers here. I don't know. But we're going to find out in the next episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, smack that like button with your war hammers. And as always, share this around with your friends. Help these king's forces grow. And I will see all of you guys. In the next battle.